Brandy Glanbell is finally telling her side of the story about the alleged meeting she had with Denise Richards, who used to be on The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. So, what went down between Brandy Glanville of The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills and Denise Richards? Wanna know more? Hang tight till the end as, in this video, we are going to talk about this in detail with you. Glanville, who is 47 years old, told Daily Mail TV that Richards, who is 49, was sexually aggressive toward her when they met for the first time on September 18, 2018 at Randy Gerber's Cafe Habana in Malibu. After that, she said, they had a secret affair. Richards has strongly denied Glanville's claims that he and another woman had a tryst in the past. Glanville, on the other hand, said that her agent set up the meeting so that she could give Richards advice about joining RACOBH, since he was also taking her on as a client, but it turned into more than that. We went to dinner, and Denise sat next to me the whole time, staring at my breasts, she said. Then our agent left because it was getting late for him, but we stayed because we were having a great time and getting along. She went on, then Denise said to me, oh my god, does it seem like I've been looking at your blanks all night? I'm like, yeah, pretty much. Then, Richards is said to have told Glanville that she was thinking about getting breast surgery herself and asked to see Glanville's work. We went into the bathroom and I took my shirt off and showed her my chest. Glanville said, Glanville said that she was down for it and that she really didn't mind being kissed. She said, we were drunk and it's not the first time I've kissed a friend or girl. It was a compliment and it made me feel good. She is a very pretty girl. Her name is Denise Richards. The two people are then said to have gone back to the table to get more drinks before going back into the bathroom. Glanville said, we were just making out and I was wearing jeans. There was nothing but a little bit of sucking, but it was hot. When they decided to leave the restaurant, Richards reportedly asked Glanville not to tell anyone about their makeout sessions, and Glanville didn't know that Richards had just gotten married to Aaron Fipers. Glanville said that Richards kept wanting to see her after that. She never stopped since the first night we met, she said. I thought she wanted to finish what she had started. She went on. She sent me a text message every single day. Oh, I'm in your area. Can I just drop by? Can I stop by? I need to talk to you. I said, well, we can get together for a drink or dinner. I just didn't want to be alone with her because I felt like she wanted me and she had a lot of dude energy. Richard said he didn't talk to Glanville a lot during the episodes of RAOBH, which are currently airing. Soon after, Glanville and Richards filmed a scene for the Bravo show together in November. Glanville said that afterward, they went back to Cafe Habana with Richard's husband, Vipers. Glanville said that the conversation quickly turned to the threesomes the two of them had had with other women. She said, they talked about how they get other women to join their marriages and sleep with them. They wanted to know if I could help. Um, call Charlie Sheen, I said. From 2002 to 2006, Richards and Sheen, who was 55, were married. Glanville said, all night long, we talked about mating and how Fipers was fine as long as she was with a girl but could never be with a guy. It was an interesting conversation that made me think, okay, these are very openly sexual people. When Glanville decided to go with Richards to Mendocino Caliph, where Richards was making a movie, their relationship finally got hot. Glanville had said before that they slept together on the trip. Now, she says that Patrick Muldoon, who was also in the movie, knew about their affair and asked her about it while they were recording a podcast episode. Glanville said, I got the feeling she wanted to hit it and quit it. She was very sexually aggressive, and once she got what she wanted, she didn't care. Glanville said of what happened after the alleged tryst, I didn't think it would be as big as it is. It can be found everywhere. The person who works for Richards didn't want to say anything. That's it for the day, guys. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to never miss an update from us. We'll see you at the next one. Thanks for watching.